A change is in store for Cat's bus service. Shootings and fights have been an issue, and it's led to issues with morale and driver shortages throughout the system. Now city leaders are looking for an option to be able to get a new company to manage all of that and hopefully get the system back on the right track. Queen City News anchor Derek Dellinger live in Uptown tonight with the details on this plan. And Derek, council there will be talking about bringing on a new management company, right? Uh, yes, in fact, uh, the uh, meeting itself, uh, well, they're doing the action review meeting right now. The business meeting should be coming up very shortly, and that's one of the things on the list of discussion, one of several things that are actually on the list for tonight. But as you mentioned, though, the CATS operations management, though, it's a bit of a hot button right now, mainly because of those issues that you just mentioned. Now, we need to say at the offset here that when we are referring to CATS operations management, it has to do with a third-party company. Now, the city of Charlotte and any municipality, by state law, they cannot negotiate with unions, so that's where the company comes in. The current company, RATP Dev, has been over CATS operations through much of its most recent issues. Uh, Queen City News has been telling you for some time about the repeated driver shortages, along with assaults and worse that have happened on the CATS bus system. Now, we spoke with uh, City Councilman Malcolm Graham a little bit earlier today about all this, and he says, the, in the, with a the likely coming change, he says simply that it's about time. I think they saw the handwriting on the wall in terms of their own performance uh, and the expectation of the community. How confident are you with this new management company that the issues that have shown up over the last year will not show up again? Cautiously optimistic. Council yeah. will provide more oversight over this contractor. We have an interim CEO who's committed to delivering the service, so mm -hmm. we're all moving in the right direction. Now, as we mentioned, RATP Dev is the company that is currently over CATS operations. The other company that will likely be taking over in February, if approved tonight, they're called uh, National Express Transit. They want the they want to be the new company that will be involved again coming up in February. They do manage operations uh, in D.C., Boston, and Chicago, as well as Greensboro and Durham. And again, this is going to be one of the things that will be taken up discussion for discussion tonight. In fact, we'll have an update on that coming up on Queen City News at 10. For now, we're live in Uptown. Derek Donald, Queen City News.